Check it out. So, oh, she right. All right, Lord Jumon, you over there. Right, 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 right here. Right here. Yeah, right here. You got the mic. Give him, give Lord Jumon, Lord Jumon the mic. Oh, yeah, you gone. Okay. Come on, man. See you, bro. Come to the mic. Let me go to your party. Don't more. Don't give him nothing to drink. Don't give him nothing to drink. No more to drink. Yo, yo, so check it out. All right, I see you, Rich. Get drink with Ross. Are you doing good? All right, Ross. Are you doing good? People in it? The people in it? More fire, more fire. Let them know. Let them know. 440. Yo, 440 people? Can they, can they, how my mic picking up? Mic picking up good? Mic check is good, man. Because they not used to seeing Brother Rich. Yo, before I start, there's two things before we start. Hold on. Yo, yo, let me get some quiet, yo. We start, we start, yo. We start, we start. All right, so. You live. Yeah. In so, uh, in the beginning, what's the word? Yeah, you know what I'm saying though, like, like why, why is this the, King Simon? I mean, yes, sir. I need quiet. I need quiet, King. I need quiet, King. Got king, I need you next to me. Matter of fact, oh, I need you next to me. King. I need you next we need the glory of the King. <laughs> so, yo, so listen, 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 listen. Uh, before we start, I have to give this. i give a shout out to my technician. We talk about Bob Black, this, that, we, we and That's everybody right. always say you gotta do it, don't just say it. I have a brother that that is helping the entire community. What what everything that we see, whether it's metaphysics, whether it, whether it's black empowerment, whether That's it's right. militant, whoever you are, there's this brother that's in this community that's helping everybody. Nobody sees him. Nobody sees him. He's behind the scenes, just like nobody sees me. You know what I'm saying? Like in the corner. It's, right. it's not it's you know what I'm saying? Mercy. The work well, the brother is USALivestream.com, right? USALivestream.com. The brother is a tremendous help. So before I start anything, I got to give that brother sh a shout out. USALivestream.com. Yeah. This is the brother that helps all of us. Yeah. Yeah. All of us. All of us. He's worked with yeah, me yeah, many yeah. times. You know, so he's helped all of us. Right, right. And on that note, before we start, I want to pass it to the brother. I must have been about 20. This is important to me. This virtual live uh, album listening session. This is very important to me. This brother knew I did beats for, for, for 13 years. That's before right. anybody knew I did beats. The first thing oh, he knew about man. me before I sold the Your DVD, body, before I sold the VHS, before I interviewed anybody, this brother knew me as, yo, that's the brother that do beats. So I got to introduce this brother. He got something very important happening. That's that right. The whole world needs to attend. I mean, the whole world. This brother has inspired me. He has inspired Hidden Colors. He has inspired everybody that you know on the scenes today that's giving out, disseminating information. Throw, my, throw our name in the ring. Yeah, Blue Hill. <laughs> no, Blue Hill. Blue Hill. Red right. Hill. La no, no, Legs. Who gave me the name. Yeah. Blue pill. Yeah. <laughs> Come on now. Blue pill. Say that real quick. Say that real quick. <laughs> I wrote a book. A poetry I've incarcerated with Malcolm X's uh, yeah. grandson. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. And I was inspired to write a book of poetry at the time. And I got the names mixed up. I thought the blue was the red and what have you. Mm -hmm. So I recorded. I, I mean, I wrote the book called so the Blue Pill. So and um, you. our brother Amun kept coming to Sarnetta saying, yo, the brother got a book. It's called a blue pill. It's called a blue pill. So he went oh, and um, told, 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 yeah, it's, it's multimedia platform. Right, multimedia yeah. platforms. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're getting a little nice. It's a celebration, family. Right. All right. If you were at home watching this, give yourselves a round of applause. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. You got to see yeah. Brother Rich for the very first time. Get a drink. Yeah. All right. Get a drink. Get yourself a drink. You know what I'm saying? Roll something up. You, you know what I mean? mean? Go back to what you were saying. Yeah, yeah. yeah. lose it. I'm right there, bro. All right. You know? So Brother Amun kept telling the Brother Sarnetta, you know, the brother wrote a book called The Blue Pill, and he started calling me The Blue Pill. It just caught on on 25th. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to roll with that. 
Because every time he, you know what I'm saying, he just kept calling, he started going on camera talking about blue pill, blue pill. And I was self-conscious about that label because mm -hmm. I'm like, nah, I meant the, I was like, fuck it. Who wrote this blue pill thing? <laughs> so, you know, we attribute the brother, uh, we attribute a lot of our beginnings, our humble, early humble beginnings to, um, our be you know, to, to him opening the door in Harlem, him and our brother, Dr. Jack Felder, who just made transition. I say, you know what I'm saying? They were the two, they were the pillars, the two twin pillars in Harlem to open the gateway that allowed us to do what it is that we're doing to bring this information to the world. So he opened a gate for our brother Rich. He opened a gate for a lot of people, you know what I'm saying? So we want to give it up to our brother. He's also going to be inaugurating the uh, Appreciation Awards. You know what I'm saying? Let, let me say that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let, let tell the people about that. So, so no, tell the people about that. All right, all right. Peace and Black Power family, welcome to the Underground Railroad production. My brother Rich is in the building. And I remember when my man, the Black Magic, first told me he was making beats. I used to laugh at him. He'd tell you. <laughs> we used to laugh at him. So I'd be like, Rich, what you doing? He'd be like, yo, stop. Hey, take that beat, man. Put that in one of your, your joints. And I would listen. I'd be like, bitch, what the hell is you doing, man? But the brother have definitely got better and better as time go on. Every time I turn around, he's on his way downtown to buy new equipment. Now I find myself calling my brother, yo, brother, what you using? Because my son is involved in it now. So now I see the elevation. I see the growth. And I'm proud of him. And I see he takes charge of his post. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Proud of me of you. <laughs> this brother Rich used to come around right. my table when we had VHS tapes. Bobby Hemmett would come through. Phil Valentine would come mm -hmm. through. Delby Blair would come through. And Rich would be on the side with the VHS. One thing I'm going to tell you about him, he never left empty-handed. He Even if he didn't watch it all, he would make sure he'd come and, and show love and donate. Sometime he'd come and just drop $100 on me. How much, don't how get much you get to Bobby Emmett? How much? Uh, remember oh, that man. day? You were surprised. I was surprised. You were surprised. Yeah. I was like 23, man. That's right. You were 23. Got like four or 500. Yeah. Woo! That's right. <laughs> that's right. Change your life. That's right. So Rich would come by and sometimes he would just yeah. drop $100 yeah. 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 and don't even get nothing. He was just showing the love and the support because he knew how important this, this message was. I buy you that. I buy you that. I buy you that. I remember one day, Rich came to me and said, yo, brother. How can we get your ice? Yeah. <laughs> no, you, ain't, you ain't had a drink in a minute. I see you. Get some more. It's all right. Nah, he's all right. Let's Let's start. Start. Let's Let's start. Start. But anyway, listen. I remember my brother came to me and said, Yo, Sarnetta, what's up with Dr. Ben? We need to get Dr. Ben up um, some money. We need to give him a donation. And this is when no cameras was around, family. Nobody heard about this. So I said, Yo, Rich, we're going to go and see Dr. Ben. We went straight up to Dr. Ben's house. Rich pulled out a couple of hundred, a few hundreds. I pulled out stack, and we both gave Dr. Ben some money, man. So I know how Brother Rich loved doing what he do, and he had supported a lot in the background. A lot of us don't know that because we don't see his face. But the family that knows him knows that he supports. Tell so, about the wars. Tell all right, you. let me move forward now. Rich said, let's move on. So let me move on. We already know you have shout out to the Black Power Awards. Let me say that first. Shout, shout out. out to our brother DJ. DJ. Give it up to our brother DJ. Yeah. Yeah. DJ. Shout out to DJ. Um, he's on his third annual award coming up next year. So we need more than one just award. So I decided that we need to have that song in the TV awards going on because what other way can we celebrate our people? We need to celebrate them while they are here, while they are alive, and while they're still on the ground. A lot of us wait too long until they move on to the realm of the ancestors, to the Egungos. Mm -hmm. But we got to do it now. So I came up with the Song of the TV Awards. Okay. It's going down this summer, family. Y'all don't want to yeah. miss it. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Wasn't your awards before the other yes, awards? Come on, yeah. man. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we got it all back the first one. I won it. Right. I won it. Right. 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 I know. I, right. 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 I, I, I won, won too. too. Yeah. Yeah. The reason why I don't acknowledge that. Acknowledge that. Nah, it's a fact. Though. I did it. I tell, did tell it before. what they said. They, they might not have heard what no, they said. No, they heard what they said. Okay, okay. I did an awards first a long time ago. But the reason why I don't acknowledge it, because I am not satisfied with it. That's why. I, I did it from the heart, and but I'm trying to, I want to do it bigger now. 
You understand what I'm saying? I want to do it bigger and greater. That was a start. And that was a start. It was a start. So we got the Sun Letter TV Awards coming up this summer. Make sure you have your ass on board. And we definitely going to have our brother that's opening up tonight. He's going to come up in there. And Lord Jamal, of course, you already that's know. Right. So without any further ado, I want to bring to you my brother Rich. Come on over here, Rich. Brother Rich on Son the Sun TV Awards. Let me hear y'all say it one time. Sun Letter TV Awards. All right. Come, come on, in front of the camera. Come in front of the camera. Come on in front of the camera. Let everybody see. In front of the camera, smile. Yeah. 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 Blunt with your grandma. Yeah, everybody. Yeah. Yeah. Like that. Come on, Doc. Come on, Doc. Let me get in front. I don't see me. I don't see me. Sun Letter TV Awards. Sun Letter TV Awards. It's going down. This brother inspired me. This brother started me. This brother, uh, I remember when I first get, came to his table, I used to, just, I'm into metaphysics. Everybody knows that by now. I'm a magician. I'm what like, I used to always call him? Uh, spook. <laughs> spook. He used to tell me I was a spook. And I respect him because he does what he does and I do what I do and we don't judge each other. Right. But what I'm saying is I appreciate what the brother did for me. What he provided for me. And the brother's a magician in his own right. Absolutely. And I know that. Absolutely. The brother does magic every day. That's why he's successful at what he does. But support the Sarnetta TV Awards. Because if it wasn't for the Sarnetta TV Awards, we wouldn't even have Dr. Sabi. Who knows Dr. Sabi? I know. Remember when Dr. Sabi was at the Brothers Boutique? Son, Dr. Sabi was at the Soul Brothers Boutique. And we see it on YouTube because of Sarnetta. Because he filmed it. He was in the background looking like a Black Panther. You know what I'm saying? Filming it. So he filmed all of that. Dr. Phil Valentine. Jack, uh, Dr. Jack Felder. Um, A.A. Rashid. I remember when A.A. Rashid first came out. And he was at the Soul Brothers Boutique. Umar Johnson. Everybody came through there. Umar, Dr. Umar Johnson. Polite. Ali Bay, Brother Polite. Mm -hmm. Everybody had to come through the House of Consciousness. He's a troublemaker. I agree with that. <laughs> agitator. I, I, agitator. Agitator. That's how I, I, get him. I don't agree with everything he I do. Call him the agitator. But he is the motherfucking man at the end of the day. <laughs> and he's the godfather of what we see going on right now. So we have to acknowledge the good with the bad. Don't I see the bad, but I also acknowledge the good, and that's how you're going to succeed in life. We just want to see the bad balance. in somebody. Right. You've right. got to balance. you got to see the good in somebody. And I see that. And the brother's very... What, what, what happened? You don't no, 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 no. Don't forget his elder, Tap Productions. Don't tap. forget his elder. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, Minister Clemson Brown. Minister Clemson Brown. Shout out to Big Man. Yes, big, big Man. Big man. Big man. Brother Big all Man. Minister Clemson Brown. Shout out to all of them. Shabazz. 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 Of course. Absolutely. Everybody in here. Brother Shabazz. <laughs> um, anybody else I'm missing? <laughs> There's a whole bunch of people. Man. man. Let's get it on. Let's get it on. So that being said, we're going to start the show, family. We got an awesome album. Listen to the session tonight. Yeah. Brother Lord Jamal is hosting. Yeah. 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 Sign yeah. the TV yeah. 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 We got a lot of masculine energy here today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This, this, this sister right here decided she wants we invited a lot of females. This sister decided to come out tonight and I want to acknowledge her. And I appreciate it. I definitely appreciate it, my sister. That's right. And I brought another I one. I yeah, brought another, 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 yeah, another yeah, one. I, I want to acknowledge too. because... Come on, Queens. Come on, little people. Come on. I want to acknowledge the feminine energy tonight. I brought another one. That's right. y'all. I want to acknowledge the heterosexual pride. Straight black I want to acknowledge the feminine energy that came out to represent tonight. That's right. Because that's important to have that balance. And it's important... That, that's the only way we're going to progress, man. I can't be a king without a queen. So I definitely appreciate these females coming out. We're going to get busy with Lord Jamal, Cambada, myself, everybody else. We're back here. On that note, Sun and the TV Awards. Yeah! Yeah! All right, all right, y'all. I'll drink to that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Get some more water. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What's good, internet? <laughs> Yo, how the levels is uh, Brother Rozelle? 
Web slingers. Like I said, we got we got a we got brother an awesome Rizal, brother. I see you there. We got an awesome brother doing this live stream, man. Okay. We're gonna step our game up more and more. This brother, he's you with the technology. And yeah, panning and all that shit, right, Lord Yeah, you got the Like yeah, yeah. so, yeah, so, so yeah, artificial yeah, intelligence. Go. We got black dot. Where black dot at? Can, can, can I get a shot of black dot? Let's go to legend. Can I get a shot of black dot? Peace, peace, peace. Come on, man. We got black dot. Got a lot of royalty in the house right now. Come on, man. Legends in the building. Black dot. Yeah, black dot and his son in the building. Yeah, and his son. Generation. Yo, yo, what's your son's channel? Loop Hill. Urban X TV. This is Rays. Rays is in the house. Yo, yo, I'm like dog. Rays with all. Urban, U R B A N X T V. That's the YouTube channel. That's the YouTube channel. UrbanX.NYC is the blog. You already know what it is. NYC is the blog. That's the blog. UrbanX, 1X, not 3. That's 1X, not X, X, X. Black Dot Sun is continuing the legacy of Black Dot, so I just want to shout out. Come to the camera real quick, my brother. Come to the camera real quick. Now go! We stop. Now go! People see this brother right here. Brother Malcolm in the building. Yeah, Brother Malcolm. Hold on, man. We want to say this as well. You know, as youngsters, right? Maybe as the age of this young man, you know what I'm saying? Maybe young man, like, the way that we were. I'm trying to get back to my lily pad right now. We were inspired. We didn't exactly know what the tapestry of the level of hip hop that we wanted to express looked like. But when Brand Nubian came on the scene, yeah. we had an idea. Hey, 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 hey. We had an idea of what this shit's supposed to look like and what it's supposed to sound like. I want to give a super duper shout out to my brother, okay, Lord Jamal, Sadat X. And everybody else is around the world. Who the world in that spirit? The whole demonstration. All right? Let's start this. The whole demonstration. Come jump up to get beat down. Come jump up to get beat down. I appreciate the fact that the brothers here. You know, inaugurating this moment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? As we acknowledge our brother Cam Body that's in the building is going to continue to carry the barrel, the torch. The torch. Yeah. You feel me? To that next level. Alright, so let's get this thing underway. That's my right. favorite. Man, this is my favorite brand new right. 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 My guy, C. Ray Ball. Lawyer Walk Ball. This is my favorite brand new beer song. Lawyer Walk Ball. Lord. That shit was like. Y'all ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get it. Yeah. Yeah. You ready to do what we came here to do? Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. When it's time to play the music, who got that? Who, who, who got he got it. We got Ross up. You controlling all of that? We don't, we don't work it out. We don't work it out. I, I got it. I'm in and out. I'm in and out. I mean, uh, this is my music, make the muse sick. All right, well, check it out. <laughs> my name is Lord Jamal. We here with my man Cam Bada and Black Magic. Absolutely. Everybody clap it up one time. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And uh, what, what are we calling this, an e, uh, EP? Yeah, so it's a six song EP. Okay, so this is a six song EP called Holy Ghost. Mm. Holy Ghost. Yeah. Ethereal yeah. Prophet. That's what EP means. Oh. Ethereal Prophet. Mm. Mm. Okay, let's let's, came up with that. let's let's get into some basics first of all. First of all, let's talk about names. Let's talk about why you named this particular project Holy Ghost. What does Holy Ghost mean to you? Because, because, well, well, you know, I'm, I'm gonna tell you, a lot of different perspectives. Me, me, on me, that. me and Bada was, 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 was uh, we mic'd up. Let, let him oh, right, right, right. I think if, if I fake give it to you anyway, I think, <laughs> it, looks, I think it looks better. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, I know you mic'd up. We all should be mic'd up. Like, we all, uh, it's okay. We, 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 we was working on the project. We was thinking about the name of the EP. The first thought that came to my head, well, uh, my head was the Emerald tab Tablet. Um, and um, um, Toph. His manager, Phoenix. Tahuti. Yeah, Toph. Yeah, exactly. Tahuti. Toph, Tahuti, different, you know, my different uh, names. Um, he was like, yeah, that's a dope name. Bada didn't say nothing immediately. So we was like, we going to think about it. We going to think about it. Um, about a week ago. It's dope, but it's yeah, kind of Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we, we don't know if everybody will understand it. So, a week or two later, I seen Bada at the Phil, Dr. Phil Valentine lecture. Uh, King, uh, King Simon put it together and, and at a St. Francis College. So, we was doing an interview, and Bada just said the words, you know, this is the Holy Ghost. And I said, 
Bah, that's it. He turned off the camera. Boop. I was like, that's it. <laughs> and that's how the spirit. Why? Went. Why? 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 Because I felt it. That? So okay. if I feel it, I go. I so what does go. Holy Ghost mean to you? I think, I, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, if you don't mind, yeah. I take over. Mm -hmm. In the context to which I was talking about it, we were talking about trans state. Mm -hmm. We were talking about the zone. We were talking about that space you go beyond thought to where everything is based on your subconscious or your superconscious mm -hmm. to where you do things thoughtlessly and it seems like every time you throw up that three-pointer, it goes through that net. Okay. Mm -hmm. And yeah, uh, yeah. Us, 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 us black people, we when we in church, we call that the Holy Ghost. That's when grandma with the yeah. bad knees get out of seat. Right. She start prancing she ain't got bad knees no more. So, so, so what you say? Ain't got bad knees no more. That's true. In the production of this project, yes. that's the that's the dimension that you went to into that trans state. That's you got twenty goals. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, to the point that I only operate within the Wiccan hours, and honestly, yes. I just found out that this man is the same way. Mm. And Same with the Wicked Hours, yes, though. So, in, in my opinion, that's after 3 a.m. Mm -hmm. That's when all the normal mortals are, are, are nested safely inside of their bandaged mm -hmm. beds, mm -hmm. their, their convertible caskets. Mm -hmm. This is when I come alive. <laughs> this is when the Wi-Fi, this is when the ethereal Wi-Fi has nobody connected to mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. So so when, when, when me and this guy, we, he, anytime he calls me after 3 o'clock, I'm up. And not only am I up, but I'm like, hey, what's up? I'm wide up awake. Like he's just, wide awake. Like, you know, he ain't have Sleep, yeah. So yeah. the whole project was conceived under the spell of the Holy Ghost, which is, which is a colloquialism or or not maybe, mm -hmm. which is the proper formation of exactly what's happening to you when you allow yourself to slip into that zone. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's deep. I like it. That. Is. Right. Yeah. Let me let me just let's just back it up just real basic. Cam bottom. Yes, 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 yes. Where does that name come from? Because anybody that hears that automatically thinks of Bam. 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 Oh, Bam. Good question. Good question. Good question. Good question. Good. Oh, 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 and it's not out. It's not. Right, right. So we got the door. Hopefully it took sight from man. This, I ain't going to confront this. You Thank you. Let's, 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 let's roll the dice. Huh? Super it's Nova in the building. <laughs> Super Nova. No. Yeah. Oh, oh. oh shit! You right on time ah. too, Super. Okay. Yeah, Just keep going, please. Okay, so he's panning the he's panning the Johnny Five. This is right this now. is a <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So so I think this is a question that a lot of people would just automatically if somebody came from wherever. Yes. When they ever heard of Bambada, that mm -hmm. name, Cambada seemed like some sort of homage to Bambada, or I don't know, like, you know what I mean? Yeah. So please explain how you came with this name and, and the significance of it. Yes, yes, yes. So uh, my introduction to hip hop was uh, from my uncle. He was a uh, hip hop uh, dancer, he was a pot locker. And uh, he had two videos as a child that my grandma managed to save. And it was of him pop locking the Planet Rock from uh, Africa Bambada. And at the time, it was, it was like basically, I, I grew up on soul music and R&B. So uh, that, but that, was, that was my connection to uh, hip hop music. Um, and, and that was always in the recesses of my mind, in the back of my mind. And, and then once I realized that rapping was natural for me, that the replication of, of, of the, the rhythm patterns in rap were, were easy, um, I, around the age of 15, I started actually getting serious about rap. And around that time, the Diplomats was going. This is, uh, I was 15, 2000, uh, 2001. And at the time, the Diplomats were popular. And there, uh, my name, my, my real name is- I was gonna is, say, what was your rap name at that time? My, my name, my born name is Cameron. Uh, uh, same as Cameron Giles. Okay. Spelled the same way and everything. So people used to call me Killer Cam. Cause okay. I, I was spinning, I had the bars. Um, but obviously I couldn't use that name. So uh, upon writing a freestyle to Santana's town, he said a line that said, I'm old school like Bambada, no man's hotter. And in the, in the process of writing that line, I, you know, Bam rhymes with Cam. So I wrote, I'm old school like Cam Bada, no man's hotter. And it was just like, oh God, this is like, this is like the primary producer that brought in this sound. You know what I mean? So it's like at that time, yes, it was it was absolutely uh, based on uh, uh, Africa Bambada. However, as I got older and I got into etymology, I realized that Cam 
not only is it a, a, a visual apparatus that captures moments in time, but it's also a motor, a cam, if you have a twin cam, cam engine, shaft, right? Uh, Camshaft, uh, right? Bada in uh, like Eastern Asia is a underground currency form that's used by drug dealers. So if you take cam as the, suff uh, as the prefix and bada as the suffix, and it means automatic money. So, so it, basically, I, in an attempt to pull away from, from the stigmatic aspect to what uh, we're going through with the name Africa Bambada and what, what he's going through, shout out, shout out to everything that, that you know. Right, like how did you feel being so, <laughs> so, <laughs> backstory to first being so tied to, because, let's keep it real, you can't, Say Cambada without thinking of Cambada. So the minute all of that shit hit the fan, yeah. whether we're not going to get all into the particulars, all of that. We do but but just, I'm just thinking yeah. of how, what were you feeling at that time? Like, oh shit. Yo. Oh shit. I done named myself after the wrong motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> God, damn. Is that what you're yeah. thinking? It's a part of you. Keep it real. Yo, every time I got new evidence, Right. It got worse. He was like, damn. <laughs> and I'm just like, yo, like. Maybe I could be Cam Hurt or Cam <laughs> Jazzy J. <Jay>. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. I don't know. Um, yeah, it got nah, to the, hey, the I, first time I met him was around the time that uh, Prince, Prince passed. R.I.P. Rest in the peace. Yeah. 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 Um, and when I met him, I told him my name, and, and he was like, yo, like, yo, how, you, do you remember this? I remember, yeah, yeah, yeah. You actually dropped money, and I picked that up and gave it back to you. And I think, well, I, had, I, I, think I had 13 <laughs> cents in my pocket at the time. Um, and uh, he was like, yo, came by, and I was just like, you know, like, I, I've been preparing for this, so I had to come, that's why I said I had the etymology on the name beyond Bambada as an attempt to defend myself against this. You know, but uh, I accept it. Yeah, whatever he does beyond see see what he did as a man, Bambada. That that that's that's like his Superman cloak. You feel me? Like that doesn't erase what he did as as a as a creator. You feel me? And and one thing that I know about artists is that the majority of the most talented people on earth all have a tremendous struggle behind them, and uh, art popularly comes from trauma, you know? And uh, I said, uh, uh, I have one line, I said, my sexual trauma acts as an art muse. Um, even though that wasn't directly on me. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody, I mean, porn for the first time is a, a tiny sexual trauma. But- uh, And an art muse. Yes. <laughs> so, but, at, at this point, I think I think it works. Like it, 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 it's it's a it's it's definitely a conversational piece. Um, and uh, can I mean, was it was the was the inspiration kind of trying to you know just have a direct link to some like original hip hop shit too? Do you think that was part of it? You know what? I was process. young. I was young. Yeah, like at the time, like uh, it just it just sounded good. Like I, I didn't know anything that sounded better. Like Cam Bada, it just sounded good. Recently though, I realized that. Cambada sounds like Kabbalah. Mm. And then I said Cambala. Mm. And then I realized that Cambala is Cam B Allah. Mm. So we may be looking at some kind of, of evolution. Can be Allah. 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 Brother Rich, so so I know you as Brother Rich, but right, right, right. on this project, your name is Black Magic. Right. Probably not. The G I A. Yes, sir. <laughs> um, could you go into that? You know, from bro Brother Rich to Black Magic, what's that? What's the science behind that? It wasn't really Brother Rich to Black Magic. It was Black mm. Magic to Brother Rich back to Black Magic. Mm. Well, if you knew me that. when I was 20 years old, so I never knew me. I was always into Bobby Hammond. Mm -hmm. I was always into the occult yeah. from a young age. And so I never used to say, nigga, why don't you get some Khalid Muhammad in your life? <laughs> <laughs> you know Khalid, Khalid yeah, like, fuck the white man, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but I was into what I was into since I was 20 years old. That's what I was into. 
So that that's when I, my producer name is Sanada always knew me as a producer. Before I, mm -hmm. I saw one DVD, before I did one interview, this brother, that's why I gotta introduce him. Black Power Awards, this brother started what I'm doing today. This brother is responsible for what you're seeing today. Regardless of what you feel about him, this brother was a heavy influence in my life. So I got to give the brother props. That's right. But the brother knew me as Black Magic when I was 20 years old, as a producer when I was 20 years old. And I just got frustrated with the industry, um, Lord Jamal. <laughs> Submitted things, um, re whether it was reference songs or whether it was. Oh, what were you doing? Artists. Producing? Producing, Always. yeah, producing. You never tried and, to rhyme? No, nah, never, never. I was never a rhymer, <laughs> but just. Submitted production and I just felt as though I was better than the things they were picking right. Got frustrated and I felt as though Consciousness was more important at that time mm -hmm. Which it was because it made me the man I am today mm -hmm. So I just went that route instead of going to full throttle